guys it is monday already and i didn't vlog the entire weekend because i lost my memory card but i got a new one and today i'm just going to take you through my day and show you what i eat i'm going to show you my workout and just a day in the life so i hope you guys enjoy so i'm headed to the gym it's already pretty actually pretty late it's 7 39 i ate at like 5 30 and i just created a workout today is shoulder day and i wanted to create a workout that does not require a lot of equipment so something that someone could do at home or even if you um, work out at a gym that's always busy but you want to have like a killer workout with limited equipment that's what I wanted to share with you guys today so I'm gonna head to the gym now and I hope you guys enjoy the workout and it's getting really cold so I'm gonna put my sweater on All right guys, so I'm sitting outside because I need some fresh air. I wanted to update you guys a little bit since I didn't vlog for the past two days. Um, the past like two or three days, I've been feeling really, really bad. I've been having horrible cramps. Like I have never experienced cramps that bad. I'm waking up every like two hours and it was just horrible. So today I'm feeling it, I'm feeling sick, I'm feeling fatigued, my stomach hurts, I feel bloated. 
I have no appetite and I'm so dehydrated. And the last thing I want to do is drink water and eat, but I know I need to in order for me to like feel better. Take lunch in a little bit and then head down to the gym. But I also wanted to update you guys on my cut. Photo shoot got moved two weeks. So I was scheduled on the 19th, but I'm not 100% sure I'm gonna go through with it just because I'm actually thinking about buying a camera. So instead of paying a photographer, you know, 500 plus, I'm thinking about buying a camera that's gonna benefit me to do my own um, photo shoots and so I can, you know, have better quality videos. So I might do that. So I'm still cutting. That's my update on my cut. I'm sorry, I don't do physique updates or weight updates because I personally do not weigh myself often and I don't really take pictures. I just kind of go with the flow. I kind of stick to my plan and hope for the best. That's how I do it. I don't obsess with tracking my progress as with numbers, if that makes any sense. So I kind of just stick to my plan and if I feel like I'm not making any progress, then I obviously change things. This past three days, I just feel like a balloon. Um, it is that time of the month, so I'm holding a lot of water. But other than that, I personally see the difference in my arms and in my core and my legs are getting a little bit smaller and tighter. So I am making progress. Stay away from the scale. I kind of go by how I look and how I feel in my clothes. I hope you guys can hear me. I'm gonna go inside. An outfit of the day. I have this top. It's like a sweater. I don't know what this is called, but it's like a it's like a very loose sweater. It's from Forever 21. And my jeans are from American Eagle. Almost all my jeans are from American Eagle. These are not high rise, they're low rise. So they're not my favorite, but they're very comfortable. And now they're actually very loose and this is how I track my progress, my jeans start getting loose from my hip area and my butt area so i basically lose my butt when i cut but i'm going to try to shape it this time around my shoes are these little flats you guys down just because you guys can see me more instead of having the camera right here and you guys are on my foam roller so right i'm hungry so i gotta eat feed cider head to the gym get some work done. I'm about to show you what I'm going to eat for lunch. I've been craving this for like four days. I'm gonna put it together and I'm gonna hope it tastes good and it satisfies my craving. All right, it's Uncle Ben's rice and bean blend and then I have banana up here. I don't know if it's a Mexican thing, but I know when I was a little girl, my mom always used to make Mexican rice and she would put um, a banana on it and I think she would put sour cream. I'm not 100% sure, but I've been craving that for like four days now and I don't have Mexican rice, but I have this rice from Uncle Ben's and I'm going to see if it's good. Mm -hmm. Ooh. so it's not stupid fly so it's not my mom's rice but it's actually pretty good I don't know I've been craving it so I'm gonna eat this and I'm gonna head down to the gym <laughs> now I'm heading to the gym Daddy is home, Butter Baby. Daddy is home. Come here. Butter Baby, Hunter. who's here? Dude, what'd baby. you get me? I got me a subway. Oh. Oh, thank you, baby. I got you some chocolates. Hey, hey, look at you. It's squished. It's not squished, it's warm. It's a pumpkin. The fuck? Shaky. Why you gotta do this shit to me? All right, so it is almost three now, and I got home about an hour ago. And I just sent out messages to my clients because today is check-in day, so I'm still not done and I am gonna get it done by today, but I need a break. My eyes hurt. 
So I'm going to clean a little bit and then make something to eat because I am starving and I'm still thirsty and I've only had about a third of a gallon, which is bad. So my goal is to finish my entire gallon today. Oh, and I changed. I am just wearing this like t-shirt tied up. I'm still wearing jeans because I'm probably going to leave the house again and I don't want to have to like change again. I'm gonna drink water clean and I will show you guys what I make whenever I make it. To put this hair off. How ridiculous do I look with this hair? Pretty wild hairdo. I'm obviously having way too much fun. I couldn't take myself seriously with that bun on my head. So I'm going to make a quick meal. And like I said, I've been craving really weird things. So that's basically why I'm eating these things. So I've been craving soup and I was going to make soup myself, but it's only like a one time thing craving, if that makes any sense. Like I'm only craving it right now. And I think it's only cause I'm on my period. So, so I just bought one container and I've had this before, so I know it's good. And it is this lower sodium garden vegetable soup. And anybody interested in the nutritional facts? And I'm going to also have a side and I'm going to make a sandwich. Same thing I had post-workout. I bought these and again, I don't usually buy this, but I was craving it. So they're Portuguese rolls. And anybody interested in the nutritionals? Very simple, just put some turkey, some spinach, some mustard, and jalapenos. So here is the soup and it just has carrots, peas, I don't even know, I'll, I'll read the box in a little bit. But this is the sandwich, and it's just turkey, spinach, mustard, jalapeno. The soup has peas, potato, carrots, green beans, and tomato, and it's so good. David, can you help me get the lights out? I just realized that our lighting is still very orange. Mm -hmm. Peas. No. Do you think if I am? Um... I have to like hide my butt. On your knees, Bella. Come and help me. Can you Bella. put some pants on? I gotta hold me back. You don't want me to bend over. Put some pants on. So I'm not gonna set it up today, but I just at least got it out of the box like a week and a half later. We're gonna go walk this little munchkin now. Is that a baby? Oh. Yes. And we are here walking cider for a little bit and then I have to get back home and get to work.
So I just got back home. We went to walk cider. Then I had to train a client at the gym. And now I'm back. I'm going to make dinner, but I'm going to end the video here. I just wanted to thank you guys for watching. Please like this video if you enjoyed watching and if you enjoyed the workout and if you just enjoyed my entire day. And don't forget to subscribe so you can keep up with my life. And I will see you guys tomorrow.